Farley joined the Citrus Heights Police Department in November. Since then, he has found 47 pounds of marijuana, 29 grams of meth and heroin, and 11 grams of cocaine. It's all because of his sharp sense of smell. When we smell a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, all we smell is a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Um, but for the dog, like Farley, who has a sensitive nose, he smells the bread, he smells the wheat in the bread, he smells the sugar in the bread. And he loves two things, being held and his tennis ball. Now, he and his partner, Detective David Morans, primarily work for the post office. They have a uh, narcotics enforcement and criminal investigation task force, uh, which we do narcotics investigations. So um, as part of that team, uh, Farley and I, we assist them in dog sniffs of controlled substances being shipped through the U.S. mail. Today, Farley is demonstrating his technique. This is a training aid. Um, so if you notice, there's a bag in here that contains uh, a small amount of methamphetamine. And it's my job to hide a slip of paper that was in the jar. So we're going to go ahead and uh, tell him to go uh, find it. And what I usually I do is to motivate him a little bit. Again, he loves this right here. Hey, this is what he wants it. Mind it, come on. And that is an alert. He knows the changing in his uh, smell. Farley is rewarded with the greatest prize of all, a tennis ball and a hug. Farley doesn't know he's a drug dog. Farley just thinks he's playing. He has no idea what he does for a job. As far as he cares, I think he thinks he's a dog and he just gets to play all the time. In Citrus Heights, Mike Duffy, ABC 10.